Before we get started, it's worth noting that you will need to be signed into an Apple account on your iPhone and you will also need to have an internet connection for this to work. The first thing we need to do is to open the settings application. Now you want to scroll all the way down until you find apps and tap into that. Now you want to scroll down until you find messages and once you've found messages, you want to tap into that. Now we are inside the messages settings, you want to find where it says iMessage and you simply want to toggle this option on. A new option will appear just underneath called send and receive and this is where you can select how you want to be contacted and to contact others and this may take a few seconds to activate. Once send and receive has been activated, we can now tap into that. Here you'll be able to select which contact methods you wish to receive and to send messages from. So for this example, I wish to receive messages from not only my phone number, but my email addresses. However, when I start new conversations, I wish them to be started from my phone number only. So once we've selected any of these options, we can go back and now we can exit out of the settings application. And the next time we go to message someone who also has an iPhone with iMessage set up, we'll now be able to start using iMessage by default. And you'll know it's working because they will appear as blue bubbles.